Yo, what's up guys, Blumodice here. I want to clarify something that I may not clarified well in the last video, which is will the prices go back to normal? Also, if we assumed the prices will decrease a lot, should you get a used mining GPU that was mining 24 seven? Finally, you will have a good idea about the situation to decide to buy now or to wait a couple months. So to answer the first question, will the prices go back to normal? I don't think so. Maybe in 2024, but <laughs> don't get very frustrated because in 2022, the prices will get better, but it will not go back to normal. However, you will still be able to get a GPU at MSRP using mining. <laughs> yeah, at least like you have this option. If so if you mind with your GPU about two months to three months, you can technically get your GPU at MSRP. And if you are concerned about the safety of this process, I'll get to that later in the video. At first, let's see the huge impact of mining profitability at GPU prices. So this is the very beginning of the GPU crisis. Everyone start to know about mining and the profitability and everyone want to invest in the GPUs and yeah. <laughs> this is this is the start of the of the pathetic GPU market. As you can see, the prices get very high, and especially in May 2021, the GPU prices got three times the MSRP. This is just insane. So yeah, the prices are perfectly aligned with the profitability. And whenever the mining profitability go high, the prices will go high as well and vice versa. By the way, the red line is AMD GPUs and the green line is Nvidia GPUs. All of this is happening because people are making transactions and these transactions to make sure that it's legit and it's not fake it needs to be proofed and this is the task of miners they check if the payment is fake or not sam want to send steve 100 dollars so in order to send it successfully it needs to be verified the miners are here in the middle sam sent the transaction the miners check if it's real or not if it's real it will be sent successfully to steve and if it's not real it will be rejected and miners get profit for doing that this is how miners get profit ethereum have the most transactions which means a lot of profit but at the same time there is a lot of miners so this is why the profit is not like insane for example if we have a million transaction and we have a million miner it will be equal if we have a 10 transactions and 10 miners the profit will be equal and ethereum have the most transactions the market cap of it is <laughs> just like insane as you can see it's 5,000 Bitcoin. <laughs> and if we take a look at the other coins, it is just a joke. Like take this, uh, for example, 4.2 Bitcoin. Ergo, <laughs> Ravencoin, 36 Bitcoin. There is a very little transactions, very little commissions here. But at the same time, there is very little miners here. So this is why the profit are kind of like equal to ethereum like like for example you can make with ergo 4.2 dollars but with ethereum can make 6.6 dollars imagine all these miners go and and mine with with the other coins the profit will be a joke let's go back here for example if we got another miner so let's say this is cat cryptocurrency okay for example we got two miners both of them will get 25 cents if we assume they they have the same the same number of graphics card and hash power we got four miners so everyone will get like 20 cents or something H hope you understood the profit of uh, mining let's see these scalpers so miners decide to buy the gpu or not based on when the gpu will pay off so they will simply go and search for example 3080 okay let's say the 3080 give you a profit of six dollars they will go like this they will open the calculator and let's say the scalper said i want two thousand dollars for the 3080 yeah two thousand dollars divided by six dollars 
333 days. If we divide it by 30 days, which is a month, he will be able to get this GPU for free after 11 months. And after 11 months, he will get profit. And this is how scalpers success to sell with insane prices. As you can see here, <laughs> 130 nineties for, for about $400,000. So it is so crazy. And gamers, <laughs> gamers, they will be forced to buy from scalpers. And oh shit, the MSRP is $700. Why the price is $2,000? This is why. So let's say now the profit is no longer $6. Let's say it got like $2. And this is actually may happen. The miner will go like this. Okay, $2,000 divided by two. Oh shit, I need a thousand days to make the GPU pay off. So he will refuse to buy it for $2,000. Miners will probably like buy GPUs that will pay itself uh, within uh, 11 to 13 months so about a year okay what will happen the price of the 3080 will go down to like like two dollars multiply by 30 which is now the monthly revenue multiply by a year so they will buy it for like maximum 800 dollars okay so this is how we will get our juicy cheap gpus and like yeah this is actually what will happen to be honest after after like calculating the numbers like this i feel like the gpus are, may actually be very close to msrp so this is a good news however like <laughs> like <laughs> take my calculations with a grain of salt okay <laughs> so uh, like i don't have a crystal ball i don't have anything this is just predictions to be honest i i think they, they are relatively accurate like this is the whole situation when the profit go down the gamers will be happy <laughs> that's a stupid smile but okay <laughs> Ooh, i ten dollars so that's very nice to see so now let's answer the final question let's assume that the gpu prices drop a lot and the miners sold their gpus is it a good idea to buy a gpu that was mining 24 7 the answer is a bit complicated so if the miner was negligent and he did not take care of the gpus like he did not cooled the gpu enough maybe he did not put enough fans he did not clean the gpus from dust he did not push out the hot air from the room properly all of this affect the gpu especially the temps but like most most of the time the gpu sits in around like 55 60 so it does not hurt as much as the unstable temperature when you have a, st a stable temperature it will be great for your gpu a gpu that was mining for six months relatively okay three months is absolutely great if you found a great price for a nine months or 12 months gpu just like stressed test the gpu make sure that it's fine and you'll probably be okay hope you benefit hope you enjoyed and goodbye